In monotypes, you paint on a plexiglass plate. So it's a clear piece of plexiglass. I lay it down, work um, from sketches or photographs directly on that plate, but in reverse to the way I want it to look in the end. And it's not entirely predictable, which I kind of like too. I like organized chaos. So I can control some of the way the marks are gonna look on here. But then when it runs through the press, the press can change it. Mono print, it's just one of a kind. So they are really, truly original prints. There's only one like it in the world. This is a um, cypress pond that's in Lower Richland. And one of the things I've noticed walking through the swamp is that the cypress trees tend to grow in a line. Part of that comes from when the trees fall, then the seeds for the new trees land on the old trees and sprout up. So the line that you're seeing that they form, like right here, shows you where the old tree was. It always amazes me how few people know that we even have a national park in the area and have actually been out to see what it's like. And it's very user friendly. There are boardwalks, you don't have to get your feet muddy. So thank you, Mary. And I want to encourage everyone to come. Tomorrow night is the opening and it runs through May 12th as they're assembling the final touches at the new exhibit here at If Art in the heart of the Vista on Lincoln Street. I want to encourage you all to please catch Mary's incredible concepts of the Congaree. Thank you for watching Our Swatch. I'm William Starrett. I'm going to throw it back to the station. Have a good day, Columbia.